Hi there, this is Ivan, and this is another book review that I'm doing for my blog, Wild Pacific Northwest. This time I am actually, um, this is a book review about a fictional work. It's called Kidnapping the Lorax, and it's by Patricia Lichen. Now I would have a book here, normally, but um, I actually read this as an ebook, and uh, that's how it's available now. I'm not sure if it's available in a physical uh, form, it might be, but um, I read it as an ebook, and uh, I, I read it in an interesting way. Um, I didn't read it via Kindle or any of the other standard ebook readers. I actually read it as a PDF, and um, that was fine. It was a little bit uh, difficult. I read it on my phone here. I've got my uh, Google Droid phone, and um, I read it entirely on here. And um, the reason why I didn't use any of the other ebook readers is because I, I just couldn't figure out how to get the file open on Kindle or whatever, and uh, that's my own inability to figure the thing out, I think. I'm sure it works fine. That'd be my guess. But anyway, I read it on PDF, and it actually was, was good. I mean, I read the whole thing, and uh, I like the book. It's Patricia Lykins' first foray into fiction. Now, she has several books that I'm aware of and that I like. She has these books called Uncommon Field Guides, and there are um, collections of essays about natural things in the Northwest. She's got several books, uh, one about the mountain wildlife, another one about backyard, things in your backyard, and then another one for the coastal areas. And uh, I really like her books, I really like those books, and um, so that's why I was really interested in reading her first work of fiction, Kidnapping the Lorax. I'm not going to give away too much of the plot, I'm just going to tell you kind of the, the outstanding things that I, what I think is, is cool about the story, um, about the book itself. But uh, the, it's, it's kind of a short book, and it's in its essence, in, in very simple forms, it's about three young people who are environmentalists who decide that they're going to kidnap the Secretary of the Interior. And they give her the code name, the Lorax, and, and it's pretty obvious in the story why that is. And they kidnap her and take her off into the mountains, presumably the Cascades, to show her the beauties of our natural forest ecosystem so that maybe when she goes back to, to um, Washington that she'll do something about that, that her experiences will change her in a way that will cause her to protect these forests and, and stop the um, excessive logging or whatever. So that's the, the, the plot in a nutshell. And um, it's, it's interesting, the characters are interesting, you get to be inside of, um, of their heads, particularly of the Secretary of the Interior. And uh, so that's really interesting to kind of follow the characters along. And I'd say for me, it felt like kind of a character study story. Um, the plot is fairly basic, but you get to kind of see the dynamics of these four people over time, and uh, and it's really interesting. And, I, and I'd say that, to me, the highlight of the book is what I was looking for and what I found, which is that Patricia Lichen's knowledge of the natural history and the natural wonders of this region shine through in the book. So you get to, to see the, the plants and the wildlife, and, and you get to to kind of experience those things through the characters, and that's really, I think, the strength of the, of the story is that Patricia Lycan has that personal knowledge and, and experience that she brings into the story, and it's really cool for a person like me who has, you know, who's been out there, and, and probably many of you have, in these forests and in these mountains, that you recognize the things that she's talking about and introducing to the Secretary of the Interior in the story. So I think, um, I think that's, that's the really cool thing. So if you're a uh, naturalist in the Pacific Northwest, a nature lover like I am, then I think this book would be of interest to you because you're going to recognize a lot of things about this area in the story. The nature is, a, is, a, is a, in the forefront of the story. And, uh, and you, can, you can learn some things. I certainly felt like I learned some things. So it's, it's really cool from that perspective. And that's why, um, that's why I'm presenting this review here because normally I wouldn't do fiction, but this book, more than any fiction I can imagine, is very very closely tied to the themes of Wild Pacific Northwest. It's, it's basically, you know, it's set in the Pacific Northwest and it's all about nature up in the mountains and the forest. So if you like that kind of stuff, I, I do recommend this book. I think it's good and I think you'll enjoy it. And I want to uh, commend Patricia Lykin on her first novel and I wish her good luck in uh, getting lots of people to read it. And I look forward to her reading, uh, to writing some more books like this and of, or of any kind. So anyway, Kidnapping the Lorax by Patricia Lykin. Thumbs up. Good stuff. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.